investigators are working to figure out what caused a man to drive up a ramp and then off an interstate bridge in Cobb County. The pickup went up that HOV ramp and then through the concrete wall on the Acres Mill Road bridge. The driver died on impact. Channel 2's Christian Jennings has been covering this live. Christian DOT cleanup crews are still there some six hours after. A lot of activity out here, Justin. In fact, look up here on the bridge. The focus now is on repairing that concrete wall. They've been working quickly and around the clock since this horrible crash happened. I should point out that I noticed that we didn't see any skid marks up there on Acres Mill Road. And GDOT tells me that these types of concrete walls that you see at exit ramps all over, uh, they're not built to withstand a head-on collision at a high rate of speed. I was able to uh, assess the scene and call 911 and get EMS here as soon as possible. Philip Washington pulled over as soon as he saw a 2007 Chevrolet Silverado smash through the Acres Mill Road Bridge and land on I-75. News Chopper 2 shot this video shortly after the deadly crash. Investigators say the driver took the HOV exit ramp off I-75 North at a high rate of speed. Instead of making the turn, the driver drove straight through the intersection and smashed through the side of the bridge. I just saw the truck fly over the edge of the bridge. Uh, once it landed, I thought they were shooting a movie at first. Cobb County police haven't told us the driver's name. They're working to contact the victim's family members. Now, there are cautionary speed signs and signal ahead signs on that HOV exit ramp that the driver took. In fact, those signs were put in place after a deadly bus crash that happened on a different exit ramp um, on 75 some 12 years ago. Reporting live here in Cobb County, Christian Jennings, Channel 2 Action News.